as a Twitch streamer, there's nothing more frustrating than getting a few minutes into your stream and noticing chats complaining about the quality. When you look down at OBS, you notice that that stream indicator is going orange and red and that your frames are dropping. But don't stress. I'm gonna show you a really simple way to check this before you go live. G'day, welcome to the channel and welcome to today's video. My name's Matt, but you will know me as WFX Malice. In today's short tutorial, I'm gonna show you a simple way to be able to check the quality of your stream and allow you to troubleshoot any issues before you hit that go live button. Let's get started. Okay, so we're in OBS version 27 and you can see that we're not live and we're not recording. Go up to your file menu, choose settings, select stream from the options menu and go and click the enable bandwidth test mode. Click OK and now you can go and hit start streaming. You'll be hit with this warning letting you know that you're in bandwidth mode and this won't go live. Click yes. And now you'll notice that your stream indicator will light up to show you the quality of your stream and you'll also see your frame rate. You can go ahead and load up whatever game it is you want to stream because obviously your bandwidth is going to vary once you load into a game. Some games are heavier on bandwidth than others with upload and download. Now obviously upload is what we care about for streaming. Now this is made really simple thanks to OBS. Once upon a time you used to have to go into Twitch, you'd copy your Twitch stream link, you'd go onto their web developer page, you'd copy another link, you'd have to add that somewhere in the middle and add some extra text and brackets and it all just got too confusing and it was just too difficult to do every time before you went live. Now it's a click of a button, make sure you hit go live, jump into your game, test the quality of your stream. Once you're done testing, click stop streaming and make sure you go back to that file menu, settings, stream and untick that bandwidth test mode and you're good to go live. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. If you've liked it, give it a thumbs up and if you've got any comments or questions, leave them down below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.